What's good, everyone? It's your boy Santo G. Back at it, you already know, spreading unity, prosperity, and respect. But above all, if you're new here, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button, tap that notification bell. It don't cost you nothing, and it will help out this channel. So today, I just wanted to touch real briefly on toothbrushes and certain other utensils that we get inside jail, inside prison. To be honest, county jail, they only sell the little ones. It's like a little toothbrush. It's not even a full toothbrush. It's probably like that big. And they only sell small toothbrushes. Now, when you hit prison, they do sell big toothbrushes, but any time, and I mean any time that you get these, they're gonna cut them down the middle. I know you guys are probably wondering like, why don't they let you have normal sized toothbrushes? Well, before we get into that, man, I wanna give a big shout out to my good people at Killer Kush. You guys ain't following them, go follow them on IG. Shout out my good people at Cali Herbs Los Angeles. Shout out my good people at Hadar Extracts, Cali Bullies. And if you guys need any kind of junk removal, demolition, dumpster container rentals, get at my good people at Martinez Junk Removal. And with that being said, so these toothbrushes right here, right? The reason why they chop them down is because these right here can be used as a weapon now this one right here has rubber on it it's not just plastic this one too has like a rubber coating on top of it but you do have the ones that are all plastic and i do mean like just all plastic now those the reason why they chop them down is because you could easily shave them you could shave them make them into like a little ice pick so Anytime you get any kind of toothbrush, they chop it. I wanna say they probably chop it like right there to like where you could barely hold it, you know, get your little hygiene in. But let me just show you how quick you can shave one of these down. So we just chopping it up, right? And that noise, I don't know if you got to hear that. Anytime you hear that, you know somebody's getting busy they're making a weapon or trying to make a weapon that's how it sounds you're gonna hear that anytime you're on lockdown for like a riot or something big that happened you're gonna hear this a lot boom see that almost getting it to a point This right here is Prison 101. The quickest way to make yourself like a little ice pick or something like that, toothbrush. If you could get your hands on a full length toothbrush, man, you got yourself a little ice pick. If I have water, you throw water right there so that way it won't be that loud. If you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? If you don't wanna be loud like that, you wet the ground with a little bit of water, and it'll be a little quieter. Boom. And let me just say, this is for information purposes only. If you guys ever wonder, look at that right there. That's already almost good enough to, oh, the neck, eye or something, you know what I mean? But just a little quick demonstration of inside jail, county, like I said, I can only remember them selling the little toothbrushes. Even when you fill out a store sheet to buy a toothbrush, it ain't big toothbrushes like this, it's them little ones. Now, once you hit prison, it's out of state, for sure, for sure, you get a package, you buy any kind of toothbrushes in canteen, they gonna chop them down. When I came back to California, when I was in the CCFs, they chopped them as well. And then when I ended up going to Corcoran and Sentinella, as far as I could remember, they would cut them. You would not have a full length toothbrush. They would always cut them. And if you ever wondered why they would cut them or probably you never even know. 
The reason they cut them is because a simple toothbrush, a simple toothbrush, man, can be used to make a quick, quick weapon. It won't even take you an hour. Look at this. How long is this video like? Not even 10 minutes? And I did this just in the little time that we've been right here. I said I already got a tip on it. I guarantee you, if I had a mattress or something, it'll boom, it'll puncture through. If you hit somebody with enough force, either in neck area, eyes, it's definitely gonna penetrate. It's for sure gonna hurt the hell out of them. They're gonna be like, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh. Oh. Just for information purposes only, man. This is toothbrushes. Why they will not give you a full length toothbrush in prison and how quickly it could be made into a weapon, man. It's your boy Santo G, real raw and uncut. I got more fire content coming, more stories, stuff like that. I just been busy with work, but y'all bear with me. As soon as I have some like downtime where I got a babysitter, I'm able to just sit down and just knock out a gang of stories. I'm gonna do that so y'all stay tuned. Right now I'm on my way to go to a Halloween party. It's my nephew and my niece's party. You know what I mean? Happy birthday to them. Just wanted to shoot this real quick. Quick little demonstration. Toothbrushes, the dangers of it, why they don't give out full length toothbrushes in prison. Shout out Kelly Kush. Shout out Cali Herbs Los Angeles. Shout out Cali Bullies. Shout out Hate Art Extracts. And if you guys need any kind of junk removal, dumpster containers, rental, Get out my good people and Martinez junk removal. Here's their number. And with that being said, we out.